Okay, I can do this. We just went over this last week in professional development. I'm supposed to click on... Where is that? <sighs> this is hopeless. I need some help. Now who can I go to? When will I have a chance to talk to someone? I tried asking that teacher down the hall last time I got stuck trying to implement this new tech stuff. But I left them more confused than before I entered. Oh boy! Another new tech tool! Wait, I'm not sure I know how to make this apply to my content in the classroom. That new program looked really interesting, but I need to see it in action. Who in this building has used this tool? Urgh. Come on! It shouldn't be this difficult. Why can't I find a program that works the way I want it to? Wow. Even I'm bored with this lesson. I wonder if adding instructional technology could get my students more engaged. Who in the building knows about the cool new applications? Dear Canyons District colleague, as a part of the requirements for completing a master's program in Family and Consumer Sciences Education and Extension at Utah State University, you are invited to participate in a study focusing on what technologies are actively being used by teachers and students in the classroom, what attitudes are prevalent regarding educational technology, what teachers' perceptions are of how technology affects the classroom and students, demographic similarities among teachers who are technology innovators and early adopters, and if there is a significant difference between academic departments. If you agree to be a part of this research study, you will complete an online survey. This will be emailed to you. This should only take 20 minutes of your time. You may be asking yourself, what is the benefit to me for participating in this study? Every high school in the Kenyon School District has been invited to participate. The school with the highest percentage of participation will enjoy a catered breakfast at their next faculty meeting. In order to qualify for this breakfast, at least 75% of the faculty at your school must participate. So encourage your colleagues to complete the survey as well.